Fed Chairman Jerome Powell's remarks before the Senate on March 7th were very hawkish and suggest the Fed will raise the federal funds rate significantly further. Moreover, the pace of rate hikes looks likely to reaccelerate from 25 basis points to 50 basis points at the Fed's next FOMC meeting on March 22nd. Fed fund futures now put the chances of a 50 basis point rate hike at 67%. Markets have consistently underestimated how high interest rates are going to go. There's now a very real possibility that the federal funds rate will top 6% by the third quarter. If this possibility begins to play out, the stock market, property prices, and gold are all likely to take a significant hit. In his written remarks, Powell said, there's little sign of disinflation thus far in the category of core services excluding housing, which accounts for more than half of core consumer expenditures. The labor market remains extremely tight. The unemployment rate was 3.4% in January, its lowest level since 1969. Job gains remain very strong in January, while the supply of labor has continued to lag. As of the end of December, there were 1.9 job openings for each unemployed individual, close to the all-time peak recorded last March, while unemployment insurance claims have remained near historical lows. And he said, the latest economic data have come in stronger than expected, which suggest that the ultimate level of interest rates is likely to be higher than previously anticipated. If the totality of the data were to indicate that faster tightening is warranted,